Design of the B-80, later known as the KA-50, began at the Kamov helicopter plant in 1971 under the leadership of Sergei McKeith. Their goal was to create a helicopter that could provide ground troops with air support by fighting enemy aircraft. In 1976, the American attack helicopter competition was won by the AH-64 Apache, prompting the Soviet Union to order a similar helicopter from the Mill Moscow Helicopter Plant Design Bureau. Kamov's entry for that competition was the V-80, and a competition between the two design bureaus was announced. Kamov's V-80 design was approved in 1980, and Kamov was ordered to build two test helicopters. Kamov designers believe that combining the duties of flying, navigation, target detection, and tracking could be automated to a degree that a single crew member could perform all functions. The use of coaxial rotors had the effect of increasing maneuverability, reducing the vibrations level, and making the silhouette smaller. The helicopter also lacked a vulnerable tail rotor. To enhance pilot survivability, they took several measures. These measures included placing the engines on both sides of the airframe, which prevents a single hit from destroying both engines, and making the cockpit armored and screened with combined steel-aluminum armor and armored plexiglass. The armor consisted of spaced aluminum plates with a total weight of more than 300 kilograms, and the pilot's safety was ensured by the undercarriage design. A unique feature of this helicopter is the use of a rocket parachute ejection system in case of an emergency. The first V-80 prototype left the Kamov helicopter plant in June 1982. On 17 June, for the first time, test pilot Nikolai Bezdetnov performed a hover in the V-80, and on 27 July, the V-80 made its maiden circuit flight. Production of the attack helicopter was ordered by the Soviet Council of Ministers on 14 December 1987. The KA-50, with its unique design and features, has become an integral part of the Russian military and its legacy continues to influence helicopter design today. <laughs>